All right, so you so this is going to be question number 14. So Evan, you've told me about, you know, your history, you've told me about your 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 place in the market, you've told me about your sales, you've told me about your expires, you you explained to me how you're going to get my your deal done. Now please explain to me how the fee structure works. Okay? Well, we're not going to get into specific numbers on this particular question because it varies from area to area, place to place, town to town, and frankly, house to house. A house, you know, 39 Main Street could could be charged a different commission than 31 Main Street. So we won't get into commission, but we'll talk about it. When the seller agrees to list their house, they agree to pay a certain amount of commission. Right? That commission is typically split equally between the buy side and the sell side. So let's just say they're going to pay $100 commission. 50% is going to stay with the listing agent, or excuse me, $50 is going to stay with the listing agent, $50 is going to go to the buyer agent. Okay? That comes out of the that comes off the seller proceeds. So if the seller sells his house for $1000, He's going to pay $100 in commission, which is going to mean this sells house for $900. Okay? Now, on the sell side, there are certain things that you will pay for. Closing costs, such as tax stamps, taxes to sell your house, capital gains tax, attorney fees, P&S review, a, um, a title, uh, not excuse me, deed prep, uh, overnight payoff, prorated tax, prorated water and sewer, uh, smoke cert. 6D certificate, things like that. On the buy side, you're going to have a closing cost that range and will be disclosed to you by your lender prior to you, you know, submitting a full application. Okay, they're going to disclose to you what are, you know, fee disclosure on what you're actually paying out of your closing costs, which is typically in and around the $5,000 mark, especially right here in, in, in the greater Boston area. All right, so the fees, you pay a flat fee or a set commission, that fee or commission is divided equally amongst the list side and the buy side. Uh, the buyer agents don't typically, the buyers don't pay a buyer agent fee. The buyer agents get paid from the seller technically. Okay, it may read a little differently on the sheet, but the listing agent agrees to charge, and then half of that charge is basically issued from the listing company to the buying company to, to get their fee. So a buyer doesn't come out of pocket to pay a buyer agent. Now, of course, we all know that that commission is built into the sale price, and they're mortgaging the full amount of the sale price. So I guess, you know, you do actually pay the commission because it's built in. But it doesn't come out of your pocket. It comes off of, it comes off of the, uh, the sale price from the seller. Okay? Complicated question. Very difficult to get into exact numbers on that. But basically, the seller splits the commission evenly between the buyer agent and the listing agent. The, set, the seller has a set closing cost. Attorney fees, P&S reviews, uh, purchase, uh, excuse me, um, uh, deed prep, overnight payoff, prorated water, prorated sewer, prorated tax, that type of thing. 6D certificate, Title V inspection, which is septic, those types of things. On the buy side, you're going to get a, a, a fee disclosure from your lender that's going to disclose all the fees that you have to pay, application fee, a, you know, appraisal fee, underwriting fee, all those types of things. Uh, that's roughly in the $5,000 market, especially here in uh, the greater Boston area. All right, so that is question third. That is actually question fourteen. So we're over halfway through. All right, so hope you've enjoyed Russell Realty Minute. Please leave me a review when you get a second right here on iTunes at Work with Evan on the Twitter feed and Evan at the Russell is my email. Thanks for listening. We will move on to question number fifteen here next.